I got to read the ending, um, what, four years ago now. Um, I don't know if you've heard that story, but I, I went to visit Charleston for the first time in December of 2007. And so almost exactly four years ago now. Um, I, I met Harriet at the airport. She picked me up, and it had been a long flight. I had been without uh, food for a while, and uh, she, we, she drove me back to her house, this wonderful home in Charleston. It was built in the 1700s, just a gorgeous town home. Um, and she said, do you want dinner, as we pulled up? And she said, I have some, some bean soup that I made. It's uh, quite good. And I said, actually, I want the ending. Um, and, and she laughed, and she wouldn't fetch that for me, and I got to read, sit down and find out who killed Asmodee, and find out the fates of all the characters, and, and read all of this in, in mostly note form. So I did get that. Um, but I don't get to read the ending. It, uh, it feels, very, feels very comforting, at least, that uh, fans have liked um, these last ones as much as they've had, and that the reception has been good. And I, I can only hope that uh, you all will enjoy the ending as much um, as you've enjoyed the last book. So I will tell you this, uh, I found the ending incredibly satisfying. Um, when I got there and I sat and I read that alone quietly, and, um, and actually in Robert Jordan's chair in, um, in, his, in his room, um, just uh, you know a few feet from the computer he'd written a lot of the books on, I... I felt immensely and deeply satisfied with this conclusion um, that he wrote himself. Um, it it feel, feels right to me. And so I, I hope that you will have a similar experience.